And good morning and welcome back to the Empire of Doug. My Fallout for Horizon 1.8 playthrough. Well, we're now back at Sanctuary. Uh, we've had a look for the Tarberries. I'm just going to spend a few minutes going through the bits I would normally do. So we start with Mailbox. What we got happening today. And everything seems to take... So we got two messages. Excellent. La uh, la la la, what we got? Oh, Trailblazer, rank two. Oh, that's good news. Um, 30 basic circuitry, aluminium, a, ooh, a cargo bot. Let's get the aluminium, because I know we're short on that. And the milk Brahmin certificate. Oh, bl brilliant. So, let's have a quick look. Uh, open the container. Uh, educational material and marvellous oh actually outgoing mailbox container have we got I'm pretty sure we've probably got more in here um, production master okay open production storage let's go to the veg oh look at those Razor, wow, that, uh, four purified water, two days worth, excellent, absolutely superb. So I'm going to take all of that, massively overweight now, uh, so let's have a quick look, can't do that, uh, can't do, uh, I can do that one, no I can't, because uh, 80 hacking skill, I just want to keep touching, one bobby pin, no, no, all right, field kit, field kit, and scrap all my junk. A lot of the equipment I don't actually want to get rid of, except for maybe the sledgehammer. Well, it is. I can sell that. I want those. A walking cane, spatula, spatula, micro ledge. Thank you. Uh, laser rifle. We've got combat shotgun. I need light machine gun might be better than the one I've got and that's quite nice as well uh, we can scrap that okay and here we are and a little tiny thing need to put that on have we got everything else on <coughs> right Let us store the junk. And that should all move soon. Um, does that actually give me adjustable wrench? Um, how much is that? 30, 40, 50, 56, 60, 83. Okay. Um, right. Let's have a quick look here, shall we? Let's see. Reverse engineering. Mm -mm. Come on. Thank you. What have we got? Reverse all weapons. See, it found none, but then it gave me XP. So I'm assuming that's just because I've picked them up, not necessarily that I've got them with me. Oh, okay. So let's have a look. This tinker kit. So my weapon crafting skill at the moment is 270. That will go up to 320. And I gave myself some XP. Can be worthwhile long time. And there you go. And that everything just got moved to hangman's. Brilliant. Except for dirty water that's shared everywhere. And settler supplies. Splendid. So let's have a quick look here uh, at my personal storage. Do I want a scythe? I like them, but no. Sledgehammer, no, get rid of. I'm going to keep both swords because I just like the swords. The combat shotgun? Yeah. 
and my light machine gun that's 20% and that's 20% so we'll just keep that as is anything in here I want to put away no um, but in these oh actually before we do that let's go and weapons uh, we want weapon kit no I don't I want the field kit because we want to field scrap start scrapping equipment oh okay hmm uh, what did I want to scrap oh yes okay the scythe no keep it no no the light machine gun we can get rid of Um, I just won't use it because I'm going to be starting on uh, starting on the other thing soon right this is the raider outfit what have I actually got this raider left arm I've got okay oh what did I just do Leg T40 for you. No, that's fine. But I'm pretty sure we have got a torso. There we go. T45, T45, T45. Whole suit. Let's lock you for the minute. And let's lock you for the minute. Yeah, I can see me strolling in that, and then Piper or someone strolling in that. That's fine. And have we got? Let's have a quick look. Piper needs her hat back. Do I have? Um. Yes. So I can find that, and I'm pretty sure that she does need some glasses and I mean, look, she does look pretty good with sunglasses I've just deleted the name from those but never mind T sunglasses she doesn't need any of the auxiliary aids however let me have a look at mine What do we need? I need Science 90. Okay. That may be happening today while we look at perks. Um, I've got all my level ups to go. We need to put in the selling section. Uh, yep. Goggles Road. Oh, no. I need that for Piper. Um, I am going to keep the fatigues. No, I do want something uh, slight. I'm going to scrap those, I think. Slightly better for Piper. Hey, you say the word. Right, so Piper, you should really have a metal helmet on. And you should have some sunglasses. And you can have your press cap back. She just needs something. Look at that. Look how ratty and tatty that is down there. I mean... It's just awful. Right. Let's pop those away. Uh, I want to see how they look. Who's that? Oh. <laughs> That's Heidi. That's Mrs. GP is opening a box with a new cupboard. So sorry about the noise. But Heidi doesn't like it, so she's down by my feet. Aren't you beautiful? Oh, I'm scared, Dad. You're lovely. Come on. There's a good girl. You're all right. Oh, excuse me, bit of a cough there. Right. Um, that should be empty now. Fantastic. Because once we get settled, as I'm sure I've we can go to the courier system. We can go visit these three now to actually sell and buy. 
Right. So where are we? 230 weight. I want to get rid of all those lock boxes. Uh, oh, that's okay. Priorities first. Storage. Stuff to sell. Get rid of. Get rid of. Uh. And Piper, where are you? Yoo-hoo! Piper! Where is she? I've got your gun. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put... Can I get that? No. Mm -hmm. Come on. Out. Out, 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 out. Thank you. Uh, sometimes slow, sometimes not. And... Uh, if we go to weapons, veracity, if I go X, can I rename? No. Right. Well, when anyone sees Piper, let me know. Oh, okay, there you are. Because that does 50 damage. That's a lot better than her weapon. And she's already a bit of a beast with the other one anyway. Right, we need my storage. We're gonna go uh, a bottle cap mine. They're very effective. Pipe bomb. Um, yeah, I don't like Molotovs. So what we're gonna do? I'm too dangerous with Molotovs. It's really that simple. I'm just way, way too dangerous. Now in my storage, uh, no weapons to put in. I've got a metal helmet. We need to go on and have a look. And oh, here we go. Excuse me again. How do they look? Um. You know, if I had a gas mask or something. But for the time being, we'll just use those. I'm sorry about this, guys, but this is this is how I play. This is what I do. What things look like matters to me. Uh, I'm going to scrap that. I don't need the T45 helmet or the arm or the radar arm. Oh, excuse me. Oh, chesty day today. <sighs> now, they're fine. That's done. Let's get rid of that rubbish. All right, trauma, rad off, rad away. Addictol, we'll put in the main one. Yeah, um, uh, advanced care about Red X. Stealth boy, we'll put away. I'll put one of those away. Carry two, no. Mentats, no. Psycho, psycho tats. Right, that's. Come on, dog me out the way. Right, so we want. Uh, rotten vegetables, rotten fruit, mouldy food, radiated blood. That can go. See, we have got some. We can have a look at doing something with those tarberries soon. Potato crisps, mmm. Gumdrops, food paste. I'm going to put in there. Fancy lad snacks, Standy boy apples, lamb corn mac and cheese. And again, uh, press that. Where are we? Um. Oh, here we are. Beer, bourbon, Gwinnett Pilsner. Right. Uh, where are we? Here we go. Fine. I think what we need to do is just have a look at the Tarberries as well. Because all of this will just go over to the master list. Or the, sorry, the master storage. 
canned dog food, dirty water, it will spread those out. Look at that. I can't believe how much purified water I've got. Alright. Research material. We've got to give those away. Master, master, bobby pin. Uh, we can sell those. Ooh, overdue book. Right. And a milk Brahmin certificate. If I'm going to do it anywhere, I'm pretty sure it's going to have to be here. Mechanist, Zoe's. I don't think I can get rid of those. No. There's my books. Right, we keep those. Ammunition. I'm going to carry this with me for the moment. Fusion cell, M around, plasma cartridges. For the simple reason is, um, I'm going to be doing stuff with it. Uh, open outgoing mailbox container. Okay. Exit. Now, um, oh, is someone new there? I'm thinking. 16 people, 15 beds. So I need to put some more beds down. Um, do you know what? We're just going to because I don't want them getting unhappy. Yeah. I'm going to put a few in here and a few in there because they're all going to be part of the main settlement. Can we talk? Oh, Jun, stop going on. Seriously. Oh, okay. The site. It has to be able to. John. Talk to the kid. Even the site has limits. I'm sorry. Got to feel sorry for him, really. He's so desperate. There's Victoria. I hope you're not a synth, Victoria. The last one in that outfit was a synth. And that's my hunter. That's Alexa. Oh no, I shouldn't say that out loud, should I? Um, yes, what do you want? She will say. Right, let's head here. So, we can do all of the razor grain. And I'm pretty sure Sanctuary, here we are, now has razor grain. Um, over here. So that should be now 42 food as soon as someone gets to that job. Yes, 42. So 40, 50, 65. So I now need some more defense. Alright, I can do 28 turrets. I don't want it too high. Only because if I want to change it, it gets really a nuisance. We've got a turret there, turret there. What is that anyway that's come up? So that's quite good. That's oh, a laser. And it's 12, that's fine. And I'm going to put one over here. Because once I put the milk Brahmin down... It's going to get a little... Oh, hang on. Um, there. 88. I'm not having that one. I want a better one than that one. Uh, plasma turret. Thank you very much indeed. Right. So no, no. That's the automated crops. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just razor grain. 
I need I need four Tarberries and Settler Skill Survival three. Okay. What's this one? Oh, ten water. Oh, actually, that looks good. And that's with vendor credit, wood supply. I don't want to use the vendor credit just yet. Large, that's nice. Right, the wild garden. I don't have enough dry seeds yet. Okay. Oh, Codsworth. Just the person. I want you to go to Grey Garden. You can go and mix with all the robots. Right. I am apparently very hungry. I am indeed very hungry. Uh, it's going to be two days worth of rations really, isn't it? Although I can make loads of stuff. Hydrate, night vision, Basic meals, common meals. I can make exotic two round meat. Let's have a look, shall we? Okay, loads of fish. Um, those eggs are marvellous for exotic food. I think there's even one place when we get there that's got almost like a, um, a whole case of cram. How to get excited over the strangest meals. So an animal stew. Okay, and I'm going to do my beverages, do that, and a common meal, exotic meal, oh, I have to leave, and in we go, and we go exotic, there. So we're now starting to get to the stage where it's more, it's a lot easier. Um, I'll have one animal stew. Yeah, I'm still hungry. I'm just tidying up my supplies here a bit. 13 would be the workshop rations. And water. Done. So now we can just send tidy up the bits we've actually got a Minuteman outfit I'm okay that's for sale dirty and clean tools use filters oh actually I need to probably scrap those first. And have we got flame of fuel? Yes. And I've also got a mini nuke as well that I do want to get rid of. So I'm sorry about this. We've had like 25 minutes of just running around doing stuff. But normally I will do this um, away. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Away from the camera. I just wanted to show you that as you get into it, you spend more and more time tidying up Nuka Cherry. And my overdue books. I've now got 10. Brilliant. That just means that when we go to. Um, oh, excuse me. Oh, when we head into central Boston. We've actually got quite a bit we can do because we can then go to the library and we can get the magazine from there as well. Right, so we now want to go to 
130 residents look. However, none of my communities are particular things at the moment. That's what we're going to move on to now. So if we go to command missions, in Sanctuary, I've got one technician, one hunter. And the Katars are complete. So this is good. So thank you, Heidi. Um, read the things. Your technician was successful. He's got three XP. And the next one, your hunter. He was also successful. Game in the nearby area. I don't think there are any more reports. Should be two. Fine. Let's see what we actually got. So from those two people, we got a telephone as well. And, it, and look at that. Squirrel bits. That's just one hunter who was successful who's actually level one. Now we can also go here. Uh, display local statistics. We've actually got one settler unassigned here. But we could change that. And I think this episode is going to be about how to manipulate the settings. Because what I'm going to do, we're going to take... So the hunter... Hello? Thank you. I want you to go over there. Go on, off you go. Move. Okay. Then we just come out of that. And I've stored that away. So she's now unassigned. However, we can have seven technicians in the place. So we go to production. Missions. So we've got technicians. And it doesn't really matter what you do. These fit in quite well in locations around the place. So that will be two. Technician scrounging. That should be indoors because it's like a table. Two. Three. Disassemble. Yeah. Four. Salvaging. Oh, it's a car. So that should be outside. That's over. There we are. Six. Which one should we do again? Oh, actually. I think if we put that one there. Which one? That one. No, 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 no. That one looks like it might have connections to that. Now, obviously, the next thought is, well, no one's going to be doing those jobs, are they? Not at this second. But they will be soon. Because... We're going to free up six people. Let's... You can play... Basketball there. Right. Let's go to our buildings. Now we can go... Right up to urban buildings, warehouse complex. And I need a bit of space because we need to figure out what it is and what they are. Now, we've got the Atoms Cat Marina. Oh, sorry, the Atoms Cat Garage and the Marina. Now, this is going to use a fair bit of materials. But it's worth it so we can show how we do. So let's have a look, shall we? Atoms Cat Garage. Let's have a look, shall we? Oh, and voila. So it's quite huge, isn't it, really? So we've got space for There's traders here. here. We'll find it. We will, Piper, we will. So we could have traders there. That's good. We go upstairs. And we've got this area here. And that could connect quite well to something. So now what we need to do is figure out where are we going to put this. And I'm thinking, actually, just about here. We're just going to move it and fit it into this space. Oh, I don't want a second one. Right, let's move this up the hill and see how we fit this in.
Right. How are we doing over here? Needs a slight twist to it. And over here, how are we doing? And there's still loads of room. But it needs to go down a bit because that, I don't know about anyone else, but that's going to so drive me nuts. Or. Over here is a touch flatter. Shall we have a look? I think here might be a good solution. This is empty. This is quiet. Right. There's a big location there. Okay. Let's try it right there. Although I know it's outside of town, it won't be eventually. Because I'm going to start spreading things out just a little bit like this will move down. But there's a very good reason for this. Because what we're going to do is we're going to automate the food supply here. Um, not with razor grain yet though because I planted that too goddamn early. Right, let's plant and see how this goes. Right. And... You see that fits... poorly there. We need to bring it down just a smidge. And I'm thinking over this way a bit. I want that. Come on. I want that covered over. So it's. That's better. How are we doing here? We've got some bits of weed showing through. It just needs a slight curve to the right. Like that. That's a better location. It's one of those things, I don't know. Do you ever get finickety about it? So this up. Now, this is where Move Anywhere is an absolute gem. There we go. Hmm? I wonder what Mrs. GP was doing then. Uh, she's using the uh, screwdriver. Right, let's go up a bit more. Oh, excuse me. Still coughing, I'm afraid. Sorry about that. That looks a lot better. Right. Come out. Um, manage the structure. Oh, and... It has beds. It's got five beds. That's amazing. That's very, very pleasing. Um, lock the object. Put that back to where it should be. And then we can just plop this. Uh, is that? There we are. There. Excellent. So I take it the beds are probably up here. They're a bit crowded, aren't they? No matter. See, that's a water container. Right, let's go around here and let's see what can we actually control. Beds on, signs etc, detail clutter, let's take the clutter off, right, so that's removed all that stuff, okay, so clutter I'm not worried about. Uh, we can have the clutter back on. Uh, stairs on, stairs secondary on. Detail main. Okay, signs and extras. Let's see if that gets rid of the barrels and things. No. Okay. We're just going to have to work around it, I think, really. Because I like the building, and if this was a building that we had, we'd have to work around it, because... But there's bits we can work off the side. 
Oh, come on, dog me, out the way. What I am going to do... Woo! Sorry, Piper. We're taking the beds off. Alright. Come on, out the way, Piper. Right. Because this, I want for other stuff. Right. Farming and supplies. And it's good. They're going to fit there. That's good. So. Let's go place these. Because the hard thing about these is. One. Oh, I can do 50 of these. That's good. Three, four, five, six, seven. Ah. <sighs> Because what I will do is I probably won't have a massive tarberry collection once we start getting tarberries on production. But they will be in some locations. Now. We can actually obscure the lamp a bit, but no. There. Okay. I'm thinking that'll work. Because you can run through these. And we've got all this way round here. To actually get to them as well. Quite like this area. You know what I wonder? I'm wondering... If... Will they actually fit there? No. Such a shame. Although... Oh. And need to go around this way. They will fit, but I just have to put these two in a different place. And I'm going to have Oh actually so we can get outside there One Two So we can still walk there. That's fine. We can have a little table or something up here for guards or whatsoever. And. Better. Now, if we go to. We need. No, not those. It's got to be the automated crops fit in these. One. Oh, no, I don't want that one in there. I want one. Corn. Carrots. Muck fruit. Melon. Good. And that will be for that. Right. So we've got 4, 8, tw hang on. Uh, 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 28. So if we, oh, that works even better. Because if we now go to power, normal. If we had two solar generators. Uh, facing that way. That's going to give us 30 power. And if we go connectors, I want a large one. That's going to sink in just a bit. And 
so. Right. And. And then I can have a connector. Little one. And another little one. And another little one. So we go from there to there. Pick that up. And again, this is move anywhere. If you don't have move anywhere, there are ways you can do this uh, with glitches. Oh, pop that. Just there. And I want one of those up here. So that's going to be there. There. And one. And two. Switch that back on again. And there we are. And then that one needs power. And that's waiting for razor grain. So we have all the power. Right. Get rid of that one. However, now we've got to connect that. Oh, hang on. No, get rid of that. I don't want to take anything from anywhere. No. You. Right. So now the food has got to a ludicrous level. And that's, that is an official title. All right, dog meat. And I'm going to... See, she just stands there. And Codsworth, it's very hard to get him to go to other places. Come on, Piper. Right. So now all those jobs we've got... The one I want to get rid of, I want these people doing other jobs. So... Oh, hello, you're clever. Aubrey, get up. Stop doing that. Oh, and there it goes. Hold on one second, everyone. There we go. So, razor grain, I need to keep. And, yes, yes. Yes. Right. Woo! Okay, so the only one I want doing any work is the raised grain, and we're going to put that over here near the water. So happiness is very fickle. Now the question is, are you lot going to auto-assign? They should do. But let's go and have a look at the job situation and refresh... I whatever you need. I know, Same I know. I will, I will, I'll get, I'll do this, here we go. Uh, display local statistics. Population 17, see the stability and wellness is good because we have a doctor. Now. Uh, essential, settler, essential production, or protection. Oh, they die. But only if I kill them. Right. So if we go back, and unassigned settlers, eight. Okay, I may have to do this myself. Although if I give them time, Horizon will do it. It's because I took their job away from them. So, you. We're going to start getting 
getting these people working. Total technicians throw, they're starting to actually realise. Three technicians, and we've got. You should hmm. know. People have been complaining a bit about the bed situation. Get lost. Seriously? There's more than enough beds, mate. More than enough beds. So I have four successful settlements. That means their happiness is over 75 and the population is over 15. Let's do a refresh. And command missions. Let's see. So we've now got three of seven done. And I want sanctuary to have my technicians. So if you're unemployed, I'm going to find a job for you. There are, yep, you. Because then we can start sending people out on missions. Four. You're assigned to something. You are, you're, you're working over there. You're not. Oh, you're working there, that's good. Oh, Alexa, you went there, that's fine. And five. Come on. Riley. Six. Okay. So that is one, two, three, four, five, six. Where did I put the seventh one? You know? Did I put down... Oh no, I may not have put down the seventh one. Uh, production... Technician... We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, five. So there are five. So what we're going to do two of... There's two working on the car there. There's one there, we've got two of those. Scrounging. That's a technician. What's going to look good there? Television. Broken. We got that there. That's probably round the wrong way, that one. Okay. There we are. Yeah, because you see, he's probably on that. He's on that. Oh no, there's the mat. You can tell where it is with the mat. Come on, you get on with that. So, oh, and someone's, okay, so it has actually done it. So we should have seven technicians. Now, the reason I'm doing technicians first is because I want this, the scrounging, no, the salvaging perk for my settlers. So if we go to command missions, Come on. We have seven. Yes. No hunters or engineers. But we can have eight militia. Ooh, that would be interesting to see how many we can actually do. Now, when you go to deploy your missions, you can just click on that and it will do all of them. But we've got seven technicians. So we've got... So it's going to be two of those and one of those, really. So let's see what it does when we do that. Will it do all seven? Because the more of these jobs you have... So it's done. Two threes and a one. So it's done the seven. Now, the supply kits are your limiting factor. Because if we look at militia, they're going to need military kits. Now, yes, we have got six. And we can send a lot back. And the stuff they come back with can be very nice. That's where your ballistic fibre starts to come from. Uh, so if we have a look on here, food-wise, we should still be on 42. Excellent. Defence is good. Power's good. Right. And, oh. So what I'm going to do is, for my first few main settlements, 
which is going to be really the main ones will be Red Rocket, Sanctuary and Abernathy I think are going to be my mains they will have lots of missions in them because then once we start getting lots of veg vegetables lots of fruit and meat and once we get lots of f food every day that means we will get more supply packs which means we can send out more missions because we've got technicians we've got we can make ooh eight oh we can we can do eight militia so the question is who or what settlement should be militia because militia is very important do you know I think red rocket and it's got a huge amount of people so uh, right let me have a quick look for a minute we can have eight farming supplies I can make 36 brilliant and we've got one two three four five six we can do the same again what do you do so that means red rocket so what I am going to do is I'm going to put it on pause because you've already seen what I've done I'm going to go to red rocket do the same thing again um, but this time it's going to be militia units we're going to put in place because then we start getting quite sick oh that's what I wanted to show you see, you see I'm running around all over the place because I'm quite excited to get all my militia units and things up let's have a quick look the military kits explosive materials bags of leather liquid fuel that could be something in the future and it's supplied kits but we've got enough supply kits because we can't make any more because it's purified water but we will because after these are in place then it's going to be start working on purified water to get more because I'm only going to do these two initially like this so I will be back momentarily for you let's put that up so it makes it a bit easier on the transition but I'll be back in a minute because it's nearly an hour for this show so thank you for your patience I'll be back soon and welcome back everybody to the new red rocket oh one of the mods I've got just adds a settler conversation and he goes this one guy went oh I've got an itch it's oh and it's quiet for a couple of seconds and he goes I don't suppose you could um I left the room I was just like whoa that's just no right red rocket now has a command table red rocket also people are having to sleep in shifts no they're not it's they've got brand new beds shut up god they're just so fickle right solar panels work at night and even in this weather we're just waiting on the razor grain for this so if you have a look food wise 36 so it will go to 42 soon their defense is 64 so we're okay-ish at the minute whoop although it's a bit of a mess here so what I have added as I'm pretty sure you can see is a massive great big bunker here and that is added courtesy of the architect buildings uh, ba -ba -ba. there we go the urban building small so I can do the military bunker and the restroom so there's bags of room in here however what I've done is this table has but just having you here is all we got really the area need. Covered. okay these means that I've got three military people working off of one yeah. table that's a military station that's a military Anything station that's another military station work. so and also out the front these work sites yes. are two more so we've actually Anything got eight military stations here command table I'm pretty sure I will need Ooh, so this one is probably going to become a military outpost especially with all the defense because it's everywhere produces food but this one is going to be kind of different so as you can see we've now got seven technicians we've got eight militia 
So if we're going to go back to deploy settler missions, I've got six military kits. So can I make? No. Do you know what I'm going to do? We're going to make a little tech table. Come out the way. Uh, here. Command training medical. Ooh, training we can look at soon as well. Okay, wrong place. It's under crafting. Tech lab. And all I want to do. Uh, material, cargo tools and parts. Ooh. Oh, have I picked the wrong one again? Oh, done. Uh, devices, no. Workshop level upgrades, no. Oh, here we are. Military kits, six. I've done 12, right. So we've now got more than enough for this. And if we go to command missions. Dum, dum, dum. Now we're going to send... Deploy all possible jobs. Oh, look at that, because that's an assault mission. That sounds quite fun, doesn't it? And a scouting mission. Because oh, we've got eight, so we're going to... I don't know. Let's see what they actually deploy on, shall we? Attempting to deploy settlers. Off you go, lads. Eight. Oh, so it's they've done an assault and a scout. But the point is, in two hours' time, we'll find out what they've got. And every time they go out, they are generating experience for themselves. And supply kits, we've, we're fine. Next, Abernathy would be probably on the list. And I'm thinking Abernathy should pro probably be hunters and craftsmen. Maybe. I might just put them... Oh, hello, Piper. Sorry, I was standing a bit close. I might just have them standing... Oh, might have just have them standing. I might just have them over there. And also, the other thing, when I came to Red Rocket, I had 17 people. As soon as I walked through the door, it went up to 21. And if we have a look at local statistics... Bum bum da da ba da ba. Unassigned settlers, nine. Nine settlers, unassigned. So let's have a quick look at what the security level is here. Excuse me. Um, it's only 64. Well, I'm thinking... There is no reason why we can't just use the manpower in a gentle sort of way. To boost this up. because we have lots of attacks from over in that direction oh of course I move them here oh if you've got someone on one of these workbenches you command them you tell them to move over there and then you come back a stage and it will allow you to pick it up we got one there, one there, one there. I'm thinking I might move one of those. Woo! I'm stuck under all these pillars. You know, that's just going to go there for the time being. There. So now that means we've got a 78. Let's just have a bit of fun with some of these chairs placed. Have a guard there. And what else have we got? Sentry posts. I will do all of those later on. So that's when the water goes to 43 and the food goes to 42. So that will be 88. So we will need just a touch more protection, but we've got all of that. So I'm sorry, Heidi just needs a bit of loving. Right. 
So how are we doing here? We've got all the people on. There's a little flicker underneath there. I don't know why. Could be the rain. And the other thing we should have... If I... Come on, Piper, out the way. I'm pretty sure. This is why the vendors... Are quite important. Where are we? We want entertainment. Vendor mats. A medical centre. There. Now. Also, this one's going to get a bit tight on the size. So where is my... Have I got one here? I'm sure I have somewhere. There's the chem base. There's that. Come I on, out of the way. Personally thank you for giving us this opportunity. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're very welcome. I'm not sure that you I've got a resource station here. Oh, hello, Doc. That was quick. Okay, I don't have a resource station. Alright, okay, that will have to be changed at a later date. So, let's see at the settlement. How are we doing? Come on. Uh, we have four unassigned settlers. It's a large population. But the happiness... Oh, no! Okay, what we need... To make them happy is, I'm thinking, should be downhill, if I can get to downhill from here, in the vernacular of the Australians, I think we need a dunny. So if we go to, no, where is it? Uh, production, possibly, mining oil, specialty jobs. Oh, we could have some sanitation workers. That improves happiness. Um, oh, when research. We're going to put a book in there. Only because these are one of the cheapest ways of getting research material. Which we will lose, lose use later on. Uh, where can we put that? That can go... Right there, because no one needs to do anything with it. It also adds a little bit of happiness, because people have got books to read. Right, it's not in here. What do we run out of? We run out of ballistic fibre, but that's why we're using the militiamen. Do you know what I might do? Uh, if we had... No, that's a research thing. No, mining and oil factories, no. Speciality jobs. Oh, there it is. There we are. Uh, and plus five happiness. For a toilet. And there's two other little bits I can add. There. So we have a little toilet there. That's nice. That's going to make them very happy. Which is pretty weird. Sewage management is now at three. There you go. And nope, stop. Oh, it's doing it again. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, it's going pretty well. Building here with this many people is something of a nightmare. And the last thing to do, because time is ticking now, is we want to go to, I believe. Uh, no, where is it? It always takes me a minute to find out where we are. Miscellaneous. I'll have a fast travel target. Just in here. Whoop. They do work as well. So when you come in with a caravan, that's where you're going to arrive. Those are the busy items. No, so it's not there. Furniture, miscellaneous, might be in here. What I'm after is the exercise racks. Oh, there we go. Because they produce just a little bit of happiness as well. So I'll tell you what, they will fit quite well amongst the 
soldiers doing their outdoor activities and we'll put some weights oh there we are perfect place for the weights there and that will just help their happiness just enough to push them over 75 yeah. I believe yeah I will so we've now moved on we're definitely into mid game now their house looks quite nice. This is one of the large buildings. Shut the goddamn door. And believe it or not, it only adds six beds. But if you took the beds off, you could add more if you really wanted just one place. Right. So thank you all for the today. That's today's episode sorted out. Um, I'd like to take this opportunity as well to thank you all. Those who've subscribed, truly amazing. Thank you. I'm still gobsmacked, to be honest. It's just truly amazing. Thank you so, so much. And if you do like and you're really happy with it, leave a subscribe. And also, leave a like um, and a comment if anything takes your fancy. Thank you all very, very much. Thank you for the comments I've already had and the help as well. And in the meantime, you all take care, you all be safe, and I will see you all on tomorrow's episode where we will be going to Hangman's and we're going to start doing some things around Hangman's and maybe Diamond City because we've just got to get Piper's Affinity up to 100% and then we can go and get Ada for a time or maybe Nick. We'll play it by ear. But in the meantime, thank you all so much. You all take care and be safe. Bye-bye for now.